Can you imagine to live in a cave made of uh, soil, dirt and old wood? In Norway we used to call these gamma and here is a video clip of one that we made this fall. You're so very special But I'm a creep Even though it's freezing cold, it's about 10 minus outside right now. We were up in 15, minus 15 last night, but then again, it doesn't matter when you can wake up to this every morning. So we have been out. We decided not to use the drone today because it's uh, climbing uh, under 10 minutes. It's not 13 minutes. And I don't want to risk such uh, expensive equipment. Uh, I'm using the I'm using the ND16 filter now. I could have used ND8 filter. It's a bit too much, I think. But anyway, uh, we learn as we walk, <laughs> or learn by doing. I'm going to visit some of my uh, old friends from the old uh, flight club and check out what new models uh, they have got lately. So. Uh, Let's do that before we freeze to death. Is it cold, Elna? No, it's not cold. Not at all. Are we Vikings? I'm not <laughs> sure. <laughs> I'm just crying. <laughs> but I'm a queen. Okay, now we are uh, at uh, Sven Olaf's uh, place. We are down in his um, in his hobby room or the the holy grail of a room, I think. Um, Sven Olaf is a member of uh, Sørvanger uh, Model Flight Club, the club that I was a member in before I moved to Meham. And his um, collection of model airplane is quite quite large. Also the size of the planes, so let's check it out. This is um, the Piper Cub. Um, the brand is uh, Great Planes. I think this one is the 1.8, mm -hmm. yes, 1.8, 1 uh, 1.8 meter wingspan. It's a beautiful one. and. The one that I was drooling over for many years is Espen's old uh, or new Army Cub. This one is 2.2 uh, yeah. meter wingspan. Still a virgin, never flown. With uh, how big of an engine? It's such a small room, but with so many planes. <laughs> and we have the multiplex Gemini. We have precision aerobatics, indoor planes. Uh, the Fun Cub. And also the multiplex Twin Star. Oh, <laughs> with floats. Such a beautiful plane. Um, and this one is the RC Factory Beaver, uh, Beaver yes. 
we have crashed a lot of these ones <laughs> and of course everybody should have a t-rex in their collection and here's a 450 downgraded from flybar uh, flybar less to flybar catalina. the old catalina we have some funny videos with that one yeah. you remember yes. <laughs> And what is uh, this? Is this the... Okay. The one that you got from uh, Nor Trading? Yes. Uh, I see now what you meant about the quality. Mm. Yeah. Uh, sailplanes? Yes. Oh, yes. Uh, this sailplane is 33 years old. I would never be so lucky to have a plane for 33 years old, uh, 33 year. Um, mine is crashed within two months. <laughs> oh, beautiful. What is the wingspan? I think uh, 2.4 or 2.6? 2, 2, 2. 2, 2. Yeah, okay. Also, a new one? 35 years old. That is crazy. Two years ago, you had the maiden in Lofoten. And the plane is 35 years old. <laughs> so, so you have been collecting for a while. Okay, seriously, you have the carbon cub as well? That is one beautiful model. Another room <laughs> with the RC equipment. Those were some pretty long wings. Holy crap. <laughs> that is so beautiful. Can we take it out in the light? I'm sorry you guys for the bad lighting. We don't have any movie light so you can take there we are Jesus what is the wingspan on this one it's uh, 360 360 Centegra 600 Okay, I gotta say thank you to uh, Sven Olaf for letting me uh, come here, come down into this uh, beautiful hobby room. Uh, I really, really enjoy uh, the amount of uh, models and hopefully one day I will have the same room myself. <laughs>